the northern part of the United States, you may have noticed a drop of temperature, the changing color of leaves, and maybe some ice in the morning. Or, if you're far enough north, maybe some snow. All good things come to an end, and when you finally come to grips with the fact that it's time to winterize your boat, here is a quick checklist. On your engine, you should change gear and engine oil, as well as the oil and fuel filters. Flush the engine and circulate antifreeze through the engine block and manifold, and apply grease to the external engines and lubricate where appropriate. One last thing, apply an anti-corrosion film to the engine's external parts. For your fuel systems, you're going to want to top off your fuel tanks and add fuel stabilizer. You should also lubricate your fuel pumps and the injection system. For your electrical systems, you should inspect and repair all electrical wiring and connections and remove batteries and store in a cool, dry place. If you're going to haul your boat out, store it in an indoor heated area or at least cover it. With your boat on the hard, this is also a good time to wash and wax the hull and outboard cowling. If you're leaving your boat in water, you'll want to check for leaks periodically, and if you're concerned about ice, suspend water agitators around the boat. Also make sure the battery is fully charged if you decide to leave it on the boat, and attach a trickle charger. An empty slip is a sad sight, but soon enough the weather will turn. Good luck with your winterizing, and stay warm. For more boat stories and news, go to soundingsonline.com or check out our Facebook page.